we are. YouTube should catch up hopefully soon. I just realized, what did I set the room max to? It's eight. We'll have to remake the room real quick, but hello everyone, I'm Shadow the Hedgehog, and today we're playing Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. Now let me just casually turn this from eight player max to only two. There we go. I won't have random people joining in when I'm in the middle of battling someone else. Let's see. Shadow stream. There we go. Perfect. For seven. I'll have to re-edit the room code. Let me do that real quick. MXF9H. There we are. And now people can join in and face against me in a true test of your skill. Today I'll be playing my main and seeing how well you guys stack up. Shadow, how was your kiss with Knuckles? If you're referring to that video our editor posted the other day, that obviously wasn't real. That was just him pretending to be us. I told him he should delete it, but Knuckles said that apparently people thought it was funny because it was an April Fool's Day video, but I'm still not a big fan. But, yeah. That's just a thing that happened, I guess. Three, two, one, go! I'm play another game on a stream. Whatever I decide to, I guess. Also, MBU is our first opponent, and uh, I'm already in a bit of a lead at the moment. So, currently, I'm trying to deal with the fact that the Elgato has a bit of delay. It's a bit more than I'm used to when I'm streaming. So I'm fighting through that regardless. Which with Little Mac, considering the timing they need to play him effectively, is definitely a bit hard to do. I'm very much limited by hardware at the moment. I normally would have been able to react to some of these things, but unfortunately, timing's a bit off. Out of my face with that. In fact, have it back. Hm. My super armor would have gone through that, but whatever. Up that way you go. Also, it's two matches per person, so as soon as MBUE's two matches are up, they'll be on to the next person. There we go. I should nearly avoid it, but there we go. Better. And take that. Damn. Should have seen the counter coming, but this is fine. As it currently stands, I've got the percentage lead, which is good. But it's a little max, so any kind of gimp can happen at basically any time. He's a very unsafe character, but one that I enjoy playing. Mainly because he has the speed and power. He said the funny. Which, what funny? Is Shadow winning? I can't tell. Yes, I was. Shadow, do you find April Fool's funny? I don't think a day that's all about fooling people is the most enjoyable thing. It's definitely a day that I don't really care for. It's like Valentine's, it's just kind of useless to me. I thought you were using Vegeta. That's... He's not in this game. That That's Little Mac from Punch-Out. So I guess the hair spike might make it a bit... I don't know. Similar. But even then. And we're on a Battlefield-style stage. 
just really picked out chat. Doesn't really matter though. Either way, Little Mac's still effective. No matter which stage he's on. In fact, for matches up for matchups like this, I kind of prefer a stage with platforms. I don't need KO Punch. It's more of just a nice thing to have. Completely unnecessary in this case, though. Your tournaments mean nothing to me. Up you go. And a big punch, straight to the face. That'll be a good, perfect dodge. I guess parry is the better word for it. Up that way. Missing a KO punch is perfectly fine. I don't need it. That's not so good, however. Thought I'd landed, which re would reset my side B, but I guess not. So, here we are. Go that way. I tried to time out my down B there, but unfortunately didn't come out in time. Oh, GG. You've each won one match. Go on to the next person. Whoever wants to challenge me next. Shadow, you said you couldn't sneeze, right? But you sneeze because your nose is resetting after you smell something, so how does that work if you're able to smell things then? I don't think that's how sneezes work. I'm pretty sure sneezing is an involuntary action caused by, you know, dandruff or not dandruff, but particulates getting into your nose. They can simply blow out. How many times have you eaten coffee beans? I don't know how many times have you used the restroom or had a piece of bread. I haven't kept track. Do a little more damage on them. Yes, I certainly try to. Ah, Kirby. Interesting. Hopefully I don't get neutral beat off the edge. I'll have to be careful of that. Three, two, one, go! Yeah, I missed the combo there. But that's fine. Lag on this is actually insane with the Elgato. There we go. It also doesn't help that, you know, it's Nintendo, so servers are just laggy in general. Like those random pauses there, those aren't good. Might mess me up at some point. Also, I inputted, you know, down tilt, but it did down smash instead. My favorite. This lag is actually nuts. No, take that. There you go, counter. And go away. I 
don't need KO Punch. It's just unnecessary. At least for me. It's more just a finisher move, if anything. And I don't really need to finish him off right now. At least not with that. I'd rather do it of my own merit than a comeback mechanic move. Pauses while I was trying to do my up smash were not great. Just inputs being eaten all over the place. Okay, I didn't even input an air dodge there. Go that way. There we go. One down. Shadow's winning no cap. Yes. First one down. Now for their second game. Will they change character or remain as Kirby? Let's see. I wish there were more games featuring Shadow. Yes, that would be nice to have more of me in games instead of just, you know, Sonic all the time. I mean, they even put me in as a skin, technically, in Sonic Superstars because I physically couldn't be there as I was, a, you know, in the classic era. You just killed Kirby? Yes. Yes, I did. And now they're playing Sonic. Fun. Well, time for them to die. Yeah, Sonic with platforms is, is not a great combo, but it's whatever. Why did he go down there? Just for mix-ups, maybe? I'm not sure. Either way, I need to pace out myself a bit more here. Platforms are just a little too high for that. Take that. Unfortunately, when there's this much lag, I sort of have to know what's happening a good two seconds beforehand. Very much have to plan my moves in advance. It'd also be lovely if my inputs went through as I put them, but it is what it is. Take that. Good lord, this lag is actually nuts. No. You're not grabbing me like that. Thought I was going to roll behind, didn't you? Doesn't know if the stage is very busy and hard to see much of anything with all the sh or, you know, shadows and shading and everything. Luckily, in my side's decent enough that I can understand what's happening most of it. Yep. Counter did not last quite long enough. Sonic's more or less playing keep away. But that's not going to work out for him, considering I can get to him just about as fast as he can run. Like that. <sighs> there we go. Nintendo still got them old servers from 1999. Basically, yes. Servers are not good. Just generally pretty bad. Now on to the next participant. 
Whoever wishes to challenge me, the room ID and password are in the top right. So, come in and see how well you do. Just got whooped. Yes, I'm afraid you had a run-in with a little Mac. Well, in this case, could, or, you know, their damage was not little. Three. Sorry, I can't join. Well, that's fine. I mean, you can just watch. You don't need to join in. It's only for people who want to take on the challenge. Which, trust me, this is definitely a challenge. At least compared to how my streams usually are with Smash. I'm actually trying a little bit more. that damage. And that knockback. And go away. This map is cool. Yes, it's from Street Fighter. It's a very well-made map. And the Omega form is basically just the same as the regular. At least, more or less. Well, actually, no. The regular form of this stage is very different, has a lot of platforms. I just always play the Omega version of it because it's just better. Okay. No. Okay, my punches didn't reach, but his forward smash did. Unfortunate. Uh, tried to spot dodge, but it just didn't go through. Take that. And go that way. Uh, I knew that was coming. Fortunately, couldn't quite act in time due to the amount of delay. <sighs> well, we go in the first match. Good job. Unfortunately, Ridley versus Slotomac is not the best, seeing as, you know, side B just exists. I accidentally started up immediately, but that's fine. Seems like they want to stay as Ridley. This time around, things will be a bit different. Go that way. And up. And now dead. Yeah, that's what I thought was gonna happen. Now, die. I believe I've got uh, what people in the Smash community call the read on this guy. Or alternatively called the download. Basically, I know what they're going to do before they do it. They're going to have to change up their strategy if they want to have a chance here. They're at the funny percent, so, you know, that's a thing. 
And not anymore. Yeah. I figured they are going for side B, but instead went for the forward smash. Commendable. But that's them dead. And thank you, Seven, for the $5. How's your day going? It's going well. Just playing a bit of Smash and, you know, beating people up. As you do. <sighs> well, good games, ho -o, but it's on to the next person. Why 69 funny? Ask your parents. Actually, don't ask them. Just don't, don't worry about it. You'll learn when you're older. Are you not able to sneeze if something like dandruff, pollen, or dust, or pepper has gone into your nose first? Because it happens just randomly for no reason. I'm the ultimate life form. Are you really questioning why I can't sneeze? Or why, rather, just don't? It's a very odd thing to wonder, to be honest. I don't really get it. Now we have a Mario player. Interesting. Let's see how they fare against me. Immediately with some decent combos. This one, I'm basically just studying their place, you know, play style to figure out how to beat them best. Rather, what I can do against them. Which seems to be a lot of aerial combos. So, I think I've got the solution. No, you're not getting me away that easy. Out of the stocks, but unfortunately I'm at 100%, which is not great. A grab there. Three percent for him, basically. Oh, I love lag so much. My absolute favorite. I don't know how his, which will be cancel out of mine there, but whatever. I should have super armor, but I don't know. I guess Mario's fireballs are better than I expected. Getting into that massive combo I saw where that was going. Yeah, can't do anything about that. Not on this kind of frame data. <sighs> well, good job, Mario. You've taken a first round off me. So I think I might swap characters, just for the sake of changing things up a little bit. So goodbye for a little Mac for now. And let's see. Hello Sephiroth. I return with food. Nice. That's good, I guess. I love Shadow. Well, your taste is impeccable, but unfortunately, love is not something I, you know, exactly reciprocate.
should have done down B there, but whatever. Yeah, I should have expected that. Okay, taunting, that's it. You will not survive this. Go away. No. Not going to flood me away while I'm doing my up B. It's not happening. And now you go away. I'd like to know how my LP just didn't go off then. Go that way. Hm. Can't reflect it if it's not in your reflector range. Ugh. It's just grab after grab at this point. It's getting a bit annoying. No. Take that. Ugh. Well, GG's, I guess. There we go. Question, when did you start the VTuber cam for your vids slash streams? I don't know, maybe about a year ago or something? It's been a little while. But this is just how we do them. At this point, me and Knuckles both have our little avatar things to represent us. So we use these. Shadow come home. I... Why would I do that? I'm at Knuckles' this place doing this. You know what? Random. Just because I feel like it. A King K. Rule. Interesting. That was a disaster. Yes, I do sort of step it up halfway through it, but 
unfortunately, didn't quite work out enough. I forgot that Bowser's actually fairly decent in this game. Like, not as bad as I would have thought. At least against another heavy ease. These aerials are fairly fast. I can do stuff like that. Which is just funny. We're both characters with our own sort of tough guy armor, though K. Rolls is breakable, unlike mine. Go in the middle. Ow. The teabagging feels wholly unnecessary. It's kind of dumb. that way. And die. Okay, I just couldn't even do anything there. Unfortunate amount of hits done. GG's on that first round. Decent K roll. Teabagging in 2024. Yeah, I know. That is something people do. Sorry, I had to go against such a toxic Mario player to shadow. At least you play the game the fun way. I certainly try, at least, to have fun. But, you know, it's also Smash Brothers. It's a competitive game, so I understand people being toxic. It's just. Inevitability. Oh, Dr. Mario. Interesting. Well, thank you, Isaac FG69, for the 499. Just. I don't know what that's supposed to even be. Is that a games controller, but it also looks like it's like a sentient being. I don't know what the heck it is. It says noob. I don't. I don't know. Either way. It's just. Okay. Terrific. I barely know Dr. Mario, so this will be probably very easy for the K roll. Unless I just start popping off, I guess. I don't know. This is right super armor on that. Go that way. Have a pill while you're at it. bit of medicine for the wounds I'm going to inflict on you. He rolls trying really hard for that grab combo, but he managed to get an up smash instead. I'm not gonna let myself be three stocked, that's for sure. So die. I forgot to change Knuckles' donation thing, I just realized. But, that's fine. No. Have your own crown back. Like I said, I'm at least not getting three stocked. That would just be embarrassing. Unfortunately, I don't think I'll be able to pull a win out of this. Too far behind. Between reading Chad and, you know, not knowing this character it was bit of a rough start. Go 
plenty of their characters basically have the same down air. Go that way. I tried to down me there. That'll work though. I'm doing the best with I that I can with this situation, but yeah, no, I physically couldn't move there. I didn't even try to, you know, attack it up, but it is what it is. Buffered inputs are a thing. <sighs> you have motorcycle gas? That's just the same as regular gas. Also, Samwise, that was your two turns, so GG. On to the next person. That was a disaster again. I mean, to be fair, I had no idea what I was doing with that character. In fact, I think I'll change up again a little bit. Harry. Let's see, what is his skins? I'll actually load them in. Nintendo Switch is truly a console. There we go. This is a decent Terry skin. I don't see if there's any other challengers who wish to come in and face against me. I wish they had Shadow and Smash. I mean, I'm an assist trophy, but unfortunately I'm not, you know an actual playable character. We have Cash M, our next challenger. This is one of the consoles of all time, it truly really is. With online that uh, works when it wants to. And unfortunately it is very lazy, meaning that it oftentimes just doesn't. Another Mario, interesting. I guess they didn't want to be Mario. Someone in chat just asked if I would marry them. No. Anyways, they're playing Joker. Interesting. I have a Persona protagonist versus the... SMK or SNK. Well, let's see who stacks up better. Joker certainly got some range with that dagger of his, but hopefully Terry's punches and, you know, Buster Wolves can prevail. He's already got his persona out but that's just because I've done a lot of damage. Ow. I'm surprised this person hasn't tried to do side B yet. They're just moving forward with nothing but their forward tilt. Not sure what the plan there was, but... Actually, I don't think there was even a game plan. It was just they were holding down forward tilt. Just casually sending Joker into the stratosphere over and over. But that time for real. Looks like you're fighting in hell or something. Yes, the Metroid stage does look very much like hell, but it's just Brinstar. I feel like this Joker hasn't played very much. This almost feels like bullying. It's like taking candy from a baby, which, I mean, you know, it's fine by me, but that's neither here nor there. I 
I'm trying to do the go meter moves, but fortunately it's a bit hard to do, and I'm just getting popped up into the air. Buster Wolf. Have that. to do Power Geyser, but it was a bit late on the timing. Have another Buster Wolf on the house. And a Power Geyser. How about another? Power Geyser is all it takes sometimes. Stop asking Shadow about his past. Yes, that'd be appreciated. Just, it'd be better off if we forgot the past and, you know, focused on the present and the future. Nice job, Shadow. I mean, thanks. I did a decent job, though it was a very easy one, just that match. You know what? I feel like playing Donkey Kong. Just for the sake of it. See how it does against Joker from Persona. How would a high school anime boy do against a giant gorilla? Truly really the questions we should be asking. Go into the ground. Yeah, it was a bit late. Or too early, actually. Big punch. I don't think they really know many other moves. This doesn't seem like it. Because I feel like if they did, they'd be doing something other than just, you know, forward tilt. And they don't know how to mash out of that move, so that's interesting. Yep, go that way. Roll attack. You know what? Have one of these. Just a, a grounded up from Donkey Kong. Just for you. Well, they at least know how to recover from offstage, which is good. I guess they gave up. Well, I guess that's just the end of that. GG's. Though that wasn't exactly what I would call a terrific set. You know Simp Shadow? Do you mean the one that's literally on the account named Shadow the Hedgehog? Yes. I know of him and I've spoken to him in comments at least once. But that's about it. You know what? For the next match, I'm going Game & Watch. The Red Game & Watch. Now, whoever wants to challenge me, come on in. knew that the big gorilla was going to beat a human. Yes, a human 
that's literally just a Japanese teenage high schooler. Versus, you know, the giant monkey. I mean, to be fair, it's not as if humans haven't beaten DK before. I mean, he was in Punch-Out. And plus his main opponent is Mario, who's just a guy. So, you know. That's something. We have a Rosalina player. Alright then. Some of these comments I'm reading, just I'm not even going to entertain with a response, just because they're so out there, and I I just I just don't want to. Yeah, just, that's fine. Have some oil. Once again, oil, just for you. Hot and ready. And have some bacon, why not? Have it more. Just because. And away you go. Keyed. And there I go. Boomed. Luma is dead. Big sad. Well, for you anyway. some more fish and bacon, I guess. Ow. I should probably be taking this a bit more seriously, but at this point I'm sort of also half-reading comments. My, my try-hard area of, you know, expertise is definitely not with this character. It's more just silly, I guess. That's the correct term. Just playing this character for fun. Yeah, that's about what I expected. A big Luma punch. <laughs> well, GG on our first match of two. Now I'm going to swap characters again, because I feel like it. Shadow, I just booped your nose, sorry if I annoyed you. Well, you haven't booped my nose, because obviously I'm here and you're not, so, you know. Shadow's losing brain cells by looking at chat. Yes, they actively die as soon as, you know, I take a glance over it to my right, where the chat is at. In case you're wondering why I ever look down to the right, that's because I'm looking at chat. Otherwise, I'm looking up at the screen. You know what? Lucina. Why not? Just better Marth. Team Darkstream, please. If I can get Rouge around, maybe. But she's been spending a lot of time with Knuckles, so it's not a guarantee. If you win, I'll draw Shadow in Terry's outfit. I don't know how well that's going to go for me, considering I don't really know Lucina very well. I mean, most of her stuff that I know is just her side B is very good, and her forward air is also quite decent. Three, 
Against Pyro and Mithra, this is definitely going to be a challenge, because out of the two sword fighters, Pyro and Mithra is definitely the more broken. The only thing they're missing really is just a counter. Now, Pyra is definitely the weaker of the two, though. So, at least in terms of, you know, playability. But, like Mithra is definitely the uh, stronger out of the two swords. That literally was just lag there that caused me to unshield at that time. This lag is actually terrible. This is really bad. There we go. Go that way. No, I'm not going to fall for that. It's a bit too easy. And Lucina does not have the magnet hands to get back from that. Shame. No. Well, Lucina definitely doesn't have the range or speed to keep up with Mithra. The fact that I got that kill there is, quite frankly, surprising. And Mithra just kind of invalidates most things that I do. Oh, thank you, Prelude, or Prelude Cruise, for the $5. Does Shadow also play the Gazoo? I mean, I know how to play it. You literally just hum into it. But I don't have it at the moment. I mean, Knuckles keeps it on him basically 24-7. Okay, I didn't expect that to kill. Something to side me there, but I guess it just didn't go through. Go that way. I'm going to play quite differently to how I usually do for this character. That is a very large attack range for that uh, get-up attack. But, you go away now. Yeah, couldn't get under that. Okay, I... Tried to roll get up, but I get I guess that just didn't work out. Okay. That's something. Well, GG's. That was the second match, so we're going to move on to the next person. So I think actually what I might do. I might change up the format so we're doing a four-person match because stream's nearly over and I figure we'll get more people in. So I'm going to remake the arena. Shut down. There we go. And instead of one-on-one, -on -one, it'll be four-player smash. Go, in fact, team battle. 
and I gotta make sure more people can come in. There we go. Next setup. N147, same passcode as last time. I'll go ahead and hide the text. It doesn't really matter. As you can see, the ID up on the top right. And you already know the password, so... There you go. 147. And I'm going to swap characters as well for this. You know what? Ganondorf. Because in team battles, he's actually fairly useful. So if anyone's come in from the past that wants to come back in, you're welcome to for this. This is going to be probably the last match for now. No bananas for the boy after the April Fool's video. Yes, we'll be deducting that from his pay. We got three fresh new faces. Silent D, Lazy Mix, and Sonic. I'm sure it's not actually Sonic, probably just someone pretending to be him. Budget with Shadows and Smash. Yes, it would be better if I was in the game, but unfortunately, it's not quite the case. Shadow, should I stop spamming a chat? You haven't been spamming from what I can tell, you just, you know, type, I guess. If anyone's spamming, it's Hala, who's just literally saying nothing but the Kingdom Hearts game's names. Which is definitely more spammy, if anything. In fact, we're going to give them a quick timeout. Three, two, one, go! For five minutes. And the immediate lag is great. My favorite to see. Which is sarcasm, by the way, in case you couldn't tell. Go that way. Prefer to be on the ground. Oh, I fell over. He prefers the air. I'm Ganondorf. He much prefers solid under him. So to be fair, Ganondorf does actually fly, which I don't know why they didn't include that in this game. Kind of a missed opportunity. Especially this specific Ganondorf. He should have had a better recovery, all things considered. Literally shielded Sonic's attack, but then got grabbed out of it by Lucario. Unfortunate. It's at least good that the Sonic player is the one playing Sonic. That's so easier to differentiate. around a little bit here. Not a big fan of it. Yeah, that's not good. Go away. Not a big fan of it. I'm getting focused down right now. But I'll also have to do the same to someone else. Okay, that's just lovely. Oh, good job, Silent Girl. Good luck, rather. He stayed alive longer than I did. But, unfortunately, that's the end of it. The fact that Sonic taunted makes me want to beat him into the ground. But, that's all for this stream. Going for about an hour now, so we're going to end things. So, thanks everyone for watching. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss any videos from me, and comment what your favorite part of the 
stream was if you're watching afterwards. But yeah, see you all next time.